can't walk out of the house without forgetting something for my helmet. We just need this. This piece right here. Get some appropriate music for the scooter. Sit here in this traffic. Fuck that. On your day off, trying to relax, have some fun, do some fun chores. I'd rather walk down here than be in my car. Look at all this fucking traffic. The truth is, this curb, this this scooter is totally capable of jumping this curb here. But I think it's really bad for the scooter. Fuck it, we'll stay on the sidewalk. I'm really just going to the first shop that I pass by. There's a million of them down here. So I just wanted to find a spot that would be easy to tie up. This looks like it. Yeah. Um, this is the actual piece that I need. How much is, how much are you charging for that, by the way? Uh, this is 15. Thanks, dude. No worries, See ya. That was like the dumbest system in there. I told the guy what I wanted and he went in the back and spent all this time picking out stuff that, but if, I mean, you gotta let the customer choose. I felt bad, I actually bought this $15 banger, which I'm sure I could get for 10, but I, now I still need a bowl and I still need a dome. I'm just gonna go to another shop. I don't even have to get back on a scooter. These shops, there's so many down here. There's one right down the street. Next lock up. Hey guys, you got a really, I know you love this question, a really cheap 18 millimeter bowl. That's fat, that's fat, that I got fat bowl, but 18 millimeters. Oh, okay, I see, I see. Just like, totally just straight pure glass so it's cheap I got no money you know I don't these types is there a fatter bowl than this because this is a big bowl that bowl itself is actually narrow it's nice it's shallow I feel like how much Ten bucks. good deal so I know you're working hard for your money I was gonna say and I love Joe Rogan you know I was on the Joey Diaz podcast no shit fuck yeah I'm Yogi Steve like I'm a, a doctor yeah like I'm a, a doctor yeah like I'm a, a doctor yeah exactly man I <laughs> can change but uh they got me fucked up on edibles when I was on that thing I had never tried edibles before I'm a big smoker but this was in 2015 thanks guys don't worry boss have a great day you too alrighty those guys were cool You'd think they knew who I am, man, being on the Joey Diaz podcast. The guy had the Joe Rogan hat on, so that's why I said that. Alrighty. All right, so we didn't even gas for the dome because I don't want a dome. This bowl is perfect. And now, you know, it's for, it's April 16th, so the shops are starting to have discounts, pretty deep discounts on stuff. So I'm going to get some 40% off medicine from MedMen, which is usually way too overpriced. We're going to MedMen. We're going to MedMen from here on Santa Monica. It's actually pretty far. I got a couple shops right down the street from me that are closer, but they're having 40% off some exact particular OGs that I'm interested in. 
just driving in traffic on Sunset Boulevard at 35, 40 miles an hour on a scooter, no big deal. You know what I'm just realizing? You know, for those of you guys who follow my delivery videos, you know, I put this new DoorDash box on, which is a couple inches shorter, and you can see I'm able to get my feet fully on the deck. I've noticed, I've noticed that my feet are not hurting almost at all in the mornings anymore. I think changing my feet position really went a long way. A little line, fuck. Everybody's festive for 420, it's almost here. <laughs> oh, Mike, what's going on, dude? How's it going, buddy? You haven't seen my, I'm picking up weed at the discount on discount day, right? Wow, that'd be, you got that set up now, huh? Listen, man, you got to, uh, I hope you buy that motorcycle. Are you gonna really buy it? Yeah. Because I do this group ride every uh, Sunday. All high power electric vehicles. So you'll, you will be the king of high power because that thing is just a little bit faster than everything else. Yeah. But this one goes 50. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. Alrighty, Dick. Alright. Right there in that red circle. Okay. Color. Okay. I can't fit on this fucking thing though. Come on. Here you go. <laughs> How you doing? Hello, I don't want to meet, man. Thank you. You're it's welcome. been a while. Yeah, you know, I was gonna look at the menu. Maybe you could help me. I guess I'll give you like, oh, yeah, whatever you want. I want a super high-end OG that's on sale at 40%. A good OG? Yeah. I hate that question, ma'am. Riff OG? Uh, just show me, yeah, show me what you got there. Yeah, okay. Yeah, it's full. Oh, okay. But no OG sitting over here. Let me. I'll take that OG, whatever. This from Ember Valley. I bought from Ember Valley before, yeah, so let me quality. just let me just get that then. That's okay, it, dude. Right? Thanks, bro. You're oh, a little bit of here. A little bit of shop. How you doing? Oh man, look at all these super high end concentrates. Thank you guys. This is why I have to make a list. I don't remember what I have to do. Oh yeah, I gotta do a little food shopping. Oh no, I gotta go to the bank. <laughs> and I gotta get steak. I did all the stoner shit. Now I gotta go do all the adult shit. Let's go to Sprouts. I need at least some steak and a couple other things. Let's pick up some steak. It looks like they have like kind of the type of cuts that I really like, like small filet mignon cuts. Twenty-one dollars a pound is actually not a bad price. Gonna get a couple of these. I'm also gonna get a couple of ribeyes. I really hate buying toilet paper here, but I also don't feel like parking again over at Ralph. So let's see what expensive. Well, all right, so four and a half bucks. Yeah, you th if you think my rate is high as a delivery guy, look what I'm paying for toilet paper in this area. Four and a half dollars, but this is very amazing toilet paper for your asshole. Alrighty, that's how we're getting, steak and toilet paper. Thank you so much. Nah, it's okay, we'll see you next time. Me too. All right, we did pretty good. We picked up like four or five small filet mignon and three or four ribeye. I'll go put it in the refrigerated box. That's what it's for. Looks like all of my 
stuff that could break is not going to break. I'm going to put the toilet paper on the handlebar and let's go. Uh, all right, now I just need to hit the ATM and pull money out of one account and put some money into the other account. I do really enjoy riding on my own. You know, when I work, obviously I'm working, so I have to stay focused on that. When I do the group ride, I feel a little bit of responsibility for the group. And I'm also like paying attention to shooting video. I like just riding like this, just to get shit done and go fast too. We're not conserving battery at all, so let's fucking go up the steepest hill in town right here, Camino Palmero. I try to avoid this usually, but we're not conserving gas. We're almost home. We got a full tank. This fucking thing just eats hills. Well, 35 miles an hour up hills, not bad. Hello. This is like the main street of my neighborhood, Hillside. I'm almost home. Can't drive too fast here. There's people parking to go to the Runyon Canyon Park. All right, we're home. All right, guys, I'm Yogi Steve. This is ESA, the Electric Scooter Academy. Videos about high-powered scooters and getting around on them. Please subscribe to the channel, like the video if you liked it, and leave a comment down below. You know, I appreciate your support. I'll see you later. Thank you.